Remembering a canine cop killed in the line of duty, a Canton police dog was shot early yesterday morning. He passed away a day later. Tonight, a show of support for Jethro, his partner, and the entire department. Uh, Jethro was truly one of Canton's finest. Dozens of people braving the winter weather, clutching candles and praying. But deliver us from evil. They gathered for Canton canine officer Jethro. Jethro, with his uh, Officer had come in quite a few times where I work, and um, he was a very unique dog. Not too many dogs can turn it on and turn it off, and he was a sweetheart. And it's a shame that this had to happen to him. Early Saturday morning, officers were responding to an alarm at Fisher Foods on Harrison Avenue. Officers were searching the area when shots were fired. Jethro was shot in the face, the shoulder, and the neck area. He died this morning. I feel a kinship to this officer and the dog uh, because of my husband being an officer as well. Um, we're all one family when something like this happens. It touches all of our hearts. The raw emotion of the heartbreak is clear. In our hearts, he holds the very same status as any other police officer does. Um, we work with these officers every day and we feel that they need to understand that the public as a whole do still support them. A show of support tonight for a canine who gave his life in the line of duty, protecting and serving. He took the bullets for those officers. We could be here mourning the loss of a, an officer instead. And a thank you from those who worked alongside Jethro. Your love, your support, your condolences and your kindness uh, you know, goes a long way and we definitely do appreciate it. The death of a police animal here in Ohio is a felony. Canton police expect to charge the man they say shot Jethro when he is released from the hospital.